Yeah, a lot of times the brothers run together. Johnny and Willie, or Johnny Cash, or Willie Nelson. So, who gets to come today? John's picking teams for the day. Aggie and Boulder are 14, but they both still like to run fast, so we'll let them go out today. And they're all barking and excited and wanting to be chosen. You know, choose me, choose me, I want to run too. You walk out in the morning, even if you're tired or you're crabby, you open the kennel door and the dogs all are barking and fired up and they're excited. No matter what your mood is, you open that kennel gate and they're excited and they know they're going to get to run. It rubs off on you. It always brightens your mood and you feel good after just being with the dogs for a few minutes. Most of them will run out to the line and we can hook them right up. They know the routine so they come out it's exciting at the beginning and then now they know they're going to be um, sitting here for a while until people come. When the, when the people come they'll bark and uh, in excitement and then they'll settle down again. Hi, I'm Tom. Tom, I'm John. Nice to meet you. Lightning is one of our 14 year olds right here. As soon as we meet all the dogs, they know they're gonna get their, they get water with food in it in the morning. And the boys. You guys wanna help deliver the bulls? They get to interact with them. They get to help give them a drink in the morning. They get to put the harnesses on and help hook up and get to know their personalities a little bit. A lot of people thank us for, thanks for letting us help you with the dogs. Okay, you're welcome. There's a lot of bulls to carry around. It's kind of chaos in the beginning, you know, you saw what it's like getting the harnesses on and getting them hooked up and figuring which dog is going on which team and they're all barking and excited and the, the, the customers are excited and, you know, worried about what it's going to be like. If, you, if you're going around a corner and you start tipping over, you can run a couple steps and jump back on. It's a lot easier than tipping over. Um, I'm usually in the lead when I go out. All right, you guys, let's go, let's go. It's just noise and and uh, energy and then as soon as you pull that the either the snow hook or pull the snap and release it's just quiet and just whoosh, down the trail it's it's such a tremendous joy to people that are going and i love to i love to be part of that Hello. <laughs> you're out there in fresh snow and you know it's just magical some days quiet you're sliding along it's just like magic. This is our 20th year of running sled dogs. We took a ride with a friend that had sled dogs and I just rode in the basket with her and got back in the truck and said, that was great, we gotta get dogs. <laughs> when we got our own dogs, it didn't go very well at first. We hooked him up to the sled and uh, we got about 100 yards down the road. The road started turning. We both lost the sled and uh, they ran down a couple miles down the road. <laughs> it was just, just for fun, just for us. And, you know, we'd run a team together and, and then pretty soon, you know, we each wanted our own team and, and we'd take people out with us, family and friends. And every time we took someone with us, they were just blown away by the experience. It was a joint was decision a joint to do decision this to do as a business. If you guys want to come and sit over here, we'd love a, you have some cocoa and soup and... <laughs> it would have been easy to say, forget it, a lot of times. And I think, um, you know, part of what kept us in it is we just love the dogs. What else are we going to do with the dogs? The happiness and excitement and the energy from the dogs is a huge part of it. The dogs are like our family. A lot of the dogs we raised from pups. It's a very close connection with the dogs and you know it's always really hard to say goodbye to them when that time comes. I feel so much gratitude for the dogs, I mean, especially the old dogs because they've been with you their whole life. It's you know it's been a really good life and I can't really see doing it differently. Yeah it's hard it's hard to imagine not doing it. It's a pretty stretch here going down this big hill. Good dogs. <laughs> 